India's economic liberalization since 1991 has had a significant impact on one of its greatest loves, cricket. Back then, watching cricket was an altogether different experience. State-owned Doordarshan had a monopoly on the live telecast of cricket matches in India. The Board of Control of Cricket in India had to pay Doordarshan roughly rupees 5 lakhs per game to broadcast the matches. Cut to 1993, when the board led by Jagmohan Dalmia sold television rights for the India-England series to Trans World International or TWI. Doordarshan on its part was forced to purchase the broadcast rights from TWI for $1 million. The agreement, the first of its kind in the board's history, made BCCI richer by $600,000 and allowed the board to cover financial crises looming over Indian cricket this, accompanied by the deregulation of India's television market, around the same time saw the end of the monopoly of state-owned Doordarshan. Last October, the rights for the next eight-year cycle of ICC cricket events went to Star India and Star Middle East for a reported sum of $2 billion. BCCI Secretary Anurag Thakur seized the moment BCCI got the broadcast rights as a game-changer, one that altered the fate of Indian cricket.